As a digital publisher, there are two Google products that I use extensively. That is Google Analytics and Google Search Console. One tells you what brings the traffic in from Google and the other tells you where the traffic is going on your website. Now, I'm sure you're tired of constantly switching between tabs. So today, let's learn how to link your Google Search Console to Google Analytics. Let's begin. So first and foremost, I would want you to visit analytics.google.com. Now, once you're on Google Analytics, ensure that the account that is loaded is your website. So once you've ensured it, I've confirmed that this is the website that I would want to link. I would want you to expand the panel on the left, scroll down, go to admin, click on it. Now when you see all of this on the admin page, you can scroll down and to the right you will see product links over here. You need to click on search console links so you can click on search console links now currently there is nothing linked here because i haven't done it if you see something and it's not relevant you can go ahead and remove it but if you don't see anything and you would want to proceed and add it i would want you to click the link button right on top now it asks you for the search console property that you would want to link over here you can click choose account and now it will show you all the search console that's linked to the same email id that or, the, or rather the same account that is used on google analytics i can see my website here i'm going to select that and click confirm and click next and i would want web streams as the option Website, click next and now that I've selected what stream I would want and the property I'll hit submit and once I've clicked submit as you can see the link is created it's been set up now I'm going to show you how you can get a view of search console right in Google Analytics now on Google Analytics I would want you to go to reports on reports at the bottom there is the library so you click on library and now you're going to see multiple collections now google analytics 4 has got a whole lot of different collections that are visible by default you have to click on the right button search for google search console here so like you just saw Google Search Console wasn't visible. I had to do a hard refresh on the browser to get it here. As you can see, Search Console is now visible. Now, the next step is on Search Console, you need to click the three dot, the action menu, and hit publish in case it isn't. In my case, it has been published. And now on the left, right next to the panel, you'll see Search Console. So if I were to click on search console, you can click queries and it will show you all the queries that lead people onto your website. Now my website, since it's a test website and there's not a lot of topics or queries in there, this is blank, but otherwise you'll see all your popular search queries right over here, the amount of clicks you've got from Google search, impressions, click through rate, everything and even organic search related traffic is something you can see right in Google Analytics. So you're no longer required to switch between Google Analytics and Google Search Console. 